Hey guys, Crosscutter Official here, and I challenged myself to complete a game in one week. Here's how it all began. For six months straight, I've been working on a little passion project of mine called The Lost Sun. I had completed most of the basic functions for the game, however, I ran into a huge problem. You see, after completing the basic functions, I did not know what to do next. It wasn't that I didn't have anything else to do. As you can see, my Trello board is still quite full. It's just that I didn't have the motivation to do anything. I had hit a plateau, and I needed to get out. Fast. One day, I was watching this amazing YouTuber called Andre, who had some great videos about indie game development. Most of what he said I already knew, but while watching him, something major occurred to me. I had never completed a game. Ever. And I called myself a game dev? This really changed my perspective. I knew that if I was going to be the real deal, I had to quickly make and release a small game, even if it was complete garbage. It was Sunday afternoon. I was set on making a small game. I gave myself only two hours to complete a playable prototype. Here was the plan. Basically, the player would use the mouse to keep a balloon in the air from falling into spikes. At the same time, they would be collecting points along the way. Yeah, that's it. It's a very simple game idea. Work begins now. I had recently purchased an inexpensive tripod for my phone camera, so I can make cool time lapses like this. I plan on hanging around the great outdoors a bit more and including more nature related things into my devlogs. I want to have a healthy balance between screen time and fresh air, helping me to enjoy the simple things more and more. Subscribing to this channel is also very simple. I would really appreciate it if you did. Alright, back to the challenge. After two hours of Unity compiling, after two hours of work, my time was up. I looked at what I had finished. I did it. I made something playable in two hours. I said it was playable, not complete. Cut me some slack. After making this, I would spend the rest of the week polishing my little balloon game, adding music, post-processing, sound effects, and even a- Oh, I almost spoiled it. If you want to find out how it turned out, you can play the game spoiler-free on itch.io. The link's in the description. If you don't care about spoilers, check out this video right here. Thank you all for watching. Have fun.